if we could provide... The latest video in a sustained effort to undermine support for Planned Parenthood reprises the dramatic effects that have helped the Center for Medical Progress stoke the growing controversy. Edited undercover video with a Planned Parenthood research director in Texas talking about extracting intact fetus cadavers and body parts from abortions for use in fetal tissue research. So that right. anything that we integrate into that procedure mm -hmm. without having you cover the procedural cost um, is, is, is going to be higher, right? So right, right, right. Uh, anything about higher gestational age, there's more opportunity for complications. Interspersed with talk about budgets and money. If we alter our process mm -hmm. and we are able to obtain intact fetal cadavers, then we can make it part of the budget that any dissections are this and splitting the specimens into different shipments is mm. this. I mean, that's, it's all just a matter of line items. I'm sorry. The end of the video includes graphic pictures of what is described as fetal tissue with the voices of the actors who posed as representatives of a company that collects tissue samples, asking questions and identifying body parts with Planned Parenthood lab technicians. Today, even before it was released, the leader of the group responsible for the video predicted it would have more impact than the other productions. It's perhaps going to be even more shocking. You're going to see evidence in it of how Planned Parenthood is actually willing to sail fully intact fetuses to buyers of aborted fetal tissue. On this vote Planned Parenthood, are... facing a sustained push in Congress to stop the group from getting government funding, is in full damage control mode. What we're seeing here are attacks on people's ability to get health care. Several states, including Texas, have launched Planned Parenthood investigations with the video accusing the group of offering to adjust medical procedures in order to preserve tissue and parts for research groups to purchase. There are calls for the Justice Department to investigate. Planned Parenthood asserted the footage released today doesn't show Planned Parenthood staff engaged in any wrongdoing or agreeing to violate any legal or medical standards.